Hello, my name is Sandy Timmons. I'm the Executive Director of the House of Ruth, Maryland. We're located in Baltimore City, but we serve not only the city, also the surrounding counties. We provide comprehensive services to the victims of domestic violence and their children. Those services include emergency shelter, some transitional housing programs, uh, a 24-7 emergency hotline. It's not only for emergencies, but we also provide information to people around the issue and how to be safe them yourself and also how to help family members, all done on our hotline. We have counseling services that are both individual counseling sessions, group sessions, and also child therapy sessions. The issue of domestic violence is one that crosses every socioeconomic definition you can come up with. Uh, there is no pocket of um, community that is more prone to the issue. And the statistic is a very stunning one, and it's a national statistic. Um, every major uh, survey that's done continues to come forward with the fact that one in four women at some point in her life will be in a violent domestic situation. Today, where it is clearly defined as an issue, we are gathering as a nation and as a world, we are gathering all kinds of statistics around it. There's tremendous amount of research being done on how best to serve people um, and how best to measure that success so that that can inform the work that's being done. And in addition to that, we're becoming more understanding of how all areas of the community need to work together in order to mitigate and support this issue. The House of Ruth is 35 years old. Uh, it began uh, when a group of women in the early 70s saw the severe need of addressing the issue of domestic violence and the fact that there were absolutely no resources for women and children who were involved in this crisis. So they gathered together, it was a completely grassroots effort, and found a row home on Calvert Street where uh, we had for the first time the ability to provide emergency shelter for women. We have uh, an entire legal clinic within our agency we have at any given time around 20 paid attorneys. We pay the salary and the services are provided to our clients free of charge. They are primarily to provide uh, protective orders for people who are in um, crisis, who are in danger. Um, our attorneys are located not only in this office but in courthouses around the city and the counties. Domestic violence is all about power and control. The abuser, uh, over a long period of time generally, eats away at many different facets of the abused's um, psyche. Um, there is um, a, a wearing away of the uh, victim's self-esteem, of her sense of worth, of her un, uh, ability to uh, remain an independent thinker. Uh, there is a wearing away of financial resources. What we're learning is that there is not only an emotional impact on the children, which is very easy to understand. A child who is living in a violent household can't help but be traumatized emotionally. But what we're finding now is that current research is demonstrating just how much damage is done to cognitive skills. So that has become an even more um, serious issue for all of us to be aware of and to deal with. The House of Ruth is very, very proud of the relationship that we have in the uh, police system and in the judicial system and in the legislative world. The police are the people who see this first in very, very many cases. And so the House of Ruth uh, does an awful lot of teaching of police forces in the city and in the counties to help the officers understand um, how dangerous a situation is.
many people who abuse and many victims come from backgrounds of violent households, violent relationships, abusive relationships. And so it's very likely that a woman, when she seeks her next relationship, um, will fall into the same kind of relationship. We need, as service providers, to understand that that too is part of what we need to help her understand and help her through perhaps again. Um, and it's difficult to pull through these cycles um, and we need to address this as uh, a long-term help and support for the people that we serve. <music>